My perspective on living on, on campus is, um, it's overall positive for me. I think it's very, it's, um, it's very quiet. It's a very quiet place to be. Um, but also sometimes it can be quite noisy if you're a very quiet person. Um, there's a lot of um, alone time, but there's also a fair amount of community time. So there's kind of this, always this fluctuation between when you're alone or when you're surrounded by people. Um, the campus itself, I mean, it has, you know, really nice facilities. Um, I'm very happy with the dorms. They're very quiet and clean and friendly, and we have a very nice um, kind of balance going. But I think everyone's experience with it is different. And I think it's kind of the attitude that you bring into it. And from what I can tell that people come in with kind of an easygoing attitude, then you can kind of find that it's very easy to settle in. So we have good communication. We have meetings all the time. Um, and there's always room for people to kind of uh, create what they want to create out of what they have available to them. So it's about, it really is about being proactive and reflective and listening to other people. Um, but it's a space where flexibility is required. But I think that's true for everywhere. It's just here it's, it's more obvious because you're thinking about it more. You're thinking more about, you know, how you want to relate to the environment that you're in. Um, and then you have a lot of variety because you also might spend time around the city of 10,000 Buddhas, um, which has a very different, you know, these old buildings that are, they're sometimes they're cold and old and dusty, and, but they have a lot of life and a lot of warmth to them. And so there's a lot of different kind of realms, like physical realms that you end up in. Everything's within a 10-minute walk, you know, usually much less than that. Um, so it's kind of, I don't know, it's a little bubble, but it's, it's got a lot of unique stuff going on, yeah.